morning, friends. Last night was a really good vlog experience. I really enjoyed that. And I just thought of something this morning. Since I am gay, I don't have to worry about certain social obligations. For example, having children. It's not necessarily expected that I will ever have children. I know that that's a slight disappointment to my parents because neither my brother nor myself are going to have kids. My brother got married two years ago and the expectation for that was that he would have children. We started talking about it soon after they got married and I find that kind of hilarious because it's something that has nothing to do with the rest of the family. I mean, of course they would be a part of the family if another person was born. It's something that I, as a gay person, had the opportunity to sidestep. That expectation was never for me. And I was thinking a little bit about privilege yesterday and how I know that I'm very privileged because I am a white male. The part where my privilege sort of stops is that I'm fairly effeminate, which, I mean, there's a variety of different things going on there too, and that I'm gay, of course. There are certain privileges that I get that straight white men do not get, and that's kind of one of them. There's not as much social pressure to do what society has decided it was necessary for people my age and, uh, and gender and uh, um, all of that. So I think that was an interesting little thing. I had a lot of pressure when I was growing up with my sexuality, but now that I'm out and an adult, I have a lot different privilege. And I just think that's really, really interesting. So I wanted to share that with you on my morning drive. Question of the day, how often do you think about your privilege? Do you ever think about it really? Does it come up or do you usually think of how you're not privileged? Or something like along those lines? Because I know that it's not a two-sided coin even, it's like a 20-sided dice. <laughs> so let me know your thoughts on privilege and how it uh, pertains to you in the comments down below. It's bedtime. I just finished bingo out in another part of town and got home and I made sure the dogs had food and water and now I'm in bed after having brushed my teeth because I ate a garlic burger while I was there because I get a free meal whenever I do bingo which is pretty great because they have really delicious burgers that are completely coated in garlic and garlic is one of my favorite things it's almost one in the morning it probably is one in the morning at this point I didn't even leave the restaurant until midnight. That's just kind of what happens on Tuesdays. And this is part of the reason why I have a hard time going to bed before late. Because one day a week I always, without fail, am home really late. So I'm gonna go to sleep. I wanted to talk about something today, but I don't remember what it was. Oh, I talked about it in the car earlier. That's good. Hey, make sure you answer that question from earlier today in the comments down below. Sorry I'm not more exciting today, but at least I'm getting back into the swing of things. Oh, that's something that's kind of funny and kind of bad. I accidentally posted all the vlogs planned out for today. They were scheduled and they posted on my main channel instead of my vlog channel. So, whoops. Sorry for the confusion if you were caught up in that. Sama texted me and she told me about that and I fixed it right away. Thanks, Sama. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to bed. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Wink.